considering that Apple still sells MacBooks full price with as little storage space as a New York studio apartment. I can't believe I wrote that. Chances are your drive is almost always full. So today we're gonna to be checking out a very simple application, Omni Disk Sweeper, that provides some very useful features that'll help you clear out your disk. With the release of Mojave, Apple has released a tool that helps you sort through your files, but it's quite limited. The issue is that it doesn't show you any files you've touched recently, and it doesn't show every file in your system. So that being said, the 14 different DMG files you have sitting in your downloads when you were trying to pirate Final Cut Pro a few months ago might not show up here. So Omni Disk Sweeper then. Sounds and looks exactly like a virus, but me and Chris can confirm after using it for multiple years, it's anything but. So now that we've cleared that up, Head over to the link in the description and download the appropriate version of Omni Disk Sweeper for your system. But if you're not already on Mojave, you're really missing out for three reasons. Dark mode, it has a dark mode, and it has a dark mode. When you first open Omni Disk Sweeper, you should see two or more disks. Macintosh HD and Omni Disk Sweeper. Of course, here you have to click your actual disk, so the Macintosh HD one, and then click Sweep. You should notice right away that this isn't immediate and it'll take about five or 10 minutes. I think that it's worth the wait because it'll show every single library on your computer from largest to smallest and you can individually scrape through what you wanna keep and what you wanna delete. When you find a file that you wanna delete, simply just click on it and then click the delete button. Keep in mind that you'll likely have to empty your trash when you're done and take the storage screen in your about this Mac section with a grain of salt because it doesn't always update instantly. And that's really it for this video, guys. If you're enjoying weekly uploads, let us know with a like and subscribe if you haven't already to keep updated with our new videos. Next week's video is already shot. It's on the Yamaha P45 piano, which I've had for a little bit over a year, but we're just getting around to making a review now. Uh, but until then, see ya.